There's a great story that I think it was James Wong Howe tells about doing Air Force for Howard Hawks, where they were shooting a scene where a bomber lands after the airfield had been bombed during Pearl Harbor at Hickman Airfield. And this plane lands and this guy gets out and says, what happened here? And they lit the foreground where the plane lands for the actor to come out. But the whole field was lit with some carbon arcs and it was supposed to be a magic hour shot. And right before the plane's circling to land, the generator goes out that's powering all the other carbon arcs and only the generator working the foreground is running. And they have to shoot before it gets dark and the plane is circling and Howard Hawks is saying, what are we going to do? And James Wong House said, get me a bunch of military flares. He pulled the carbons out of all the carbon arcs and he jammed as many military flares as he could into the hole. And right before the camera rolled, he had them light all the flares at once. And so all the carbon arcs acted as big reflector dishes for these military flares. So they were bright, but they were sputtering horribly and putting out all the smoke. And so suddenly this airfield is just covered in flashing, flickering, smoky light, which works because it's a scene that the field had just been bombed. And then the plane lands through the smoke and pulls up into normal lighting in the foreground. But Howard Hawks, wow, let's just do the whole movie with road flares and stuff. We don't, what do we need lights for? But it was just one of those kind of brilliant improvisational moments. 